At the Utah Test and Training Range, the Air Force conducted a flight test of the BGM-109 Tomahawk ground-launched cruise missile, or Glickum. Glickums are launched from transporters, capable of off-road movement and quick deployment to remote locations. Four transporter erector launchers, each with four missiles, and two launch control centers will constitute an Air Force tactical Glickum unit. The missile is propelled from the launch tube by a solid fuel boost motor. Seconds after launch, the boost engine is jettisoned. The wings, tail fins, and engine intake extend, and the turbofan engine starts. The 1,500-mile range Glickum is equipped with a highly advanced terrain contour matching guidance system, which compares a radar picture of the flight path with previously stored data to guide it to the target. All primary test objectives, including launch from a transporter erector launcher, transition from boost to cruise flight, separation of the boost engine, and sustained cruise flight were met. Glickum procurement started in fiscal year 1981, and initial operational capability is scheduled for December 1983.